Hello, everybody. Could I have a story for you? There was a man who lived with money. He used to get too much. He used to get three million per month. But after some time, he would go and withdraw his salary, go to a bar, make all the boys happy by dancing with a lot of ladies, spending a lot of money, and he was called Mr. Big Spender. And then there was a man who used to get 300,000 per month. But he used to go and get his money, sit down and draw a budget, and after drawing a budget, would allocate his money according to what is needed and what he needed to survive and what he needed to invest and so many things. So he sat down, make a, uh, made a good budget, and after making that budget, he would allocate his money to a particular area where he saw that there was a challenge. So these two people lived their lives together. But after some time, there reached a time whereby all of them were told to retire at the same time. Now, the man who had 300,000 per month got his money and went back and continued with the investment that he was making. And at last, he had much and he lived a very good retirement life. The, the, the first one who had, this, uh, who, who had uh, 3 million per month was also retiring. And after that time, he had to go and sit with his friends in the bar, drank the last amount of money that he had and remained with nothing. So, at last... He became poor and poor, and at the last moment, he died miserably. Now, what are the two lessons learned from these people? One, if you have a very good financial uh, financial plan that you do make a very good decision, you, you get your money, save your money, invest, and allow compound interest to work on it. You'll find that you become someone who is more wealthy and stable. Your retirement becomes easy. But if you get your money, go to a club, misuse them, you find that you are the one who is always losing. So, my point for you, learn to get your money, save your money, after by the getting your budget done, save your money, and after saving that money, get that money that you have saved, invest into a business that can generate for you money. After getting that done, you find that your money keeps on multiplying and compounding, and at the last moment, you call yourself a self-made millionaire. God bless you all.